Hello everyone, we're back. If you notice something, I'm not where I was last, because I thought I wasn't recording for a while. I was thinking, oh god, let me check. And I was recording, so we lost maybe like a minute. It's just a simple minute, did nothing big, just told the girl, like, oh, this is how you do that, this is where that painting's at. Like, how to do that puzzle. Found a new outfit. And I'm gonna be wearing it when I'm outside of clock, cl school. I won't be wearing my robe when I'm outside I of school. I hope clock. I haven't kept I you waiting out, long. I go to Hogsmeade. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsmeade. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first rate Hogsmeade experience. The hogs made. Do, 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 do. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. I'm gonna get <laughs> the drunk. Of Professor Weasley's hour was perfect. Oh, that's pretty cool. No, I don't think it's hard. Revelio. I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. <laughs> I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Damn it. It's pretty cool. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. I like when it snows. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. But that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. <laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I do not mind the cold so much. But it has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around snow. Wait, over here. I often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Here the flowers sing songs of wisdom. 
Where's Hagrid's hut? Well, actually, why did I say that? This game takes place way before that. Look, from the Forbidden Forest. Hippogriffs. I wonder Magnus. if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. Beautiful creatures, so don't piss them off. You think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. Likely already named them too. France who's been sugarfoot. That's a forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students. Oh really? Implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. Yeah, hi, the giant spiders, the uh, oh, the centaurs, and everything wants ah, to kill you. There's Hogsmeade over the crest, past that ruin. I wonder why it's forbidden and dangerous. I would spend time exploring if I could. I confess, I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that? Mm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. Rebellion! Oh, I will get you, Chuck. Let me also. Accio. Repair her. How are you settling in? I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you find you feel settled? I still miss my homeland, but it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. Revelio. So adorable. <coughs> <coughs> Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss On I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? Jemmy, guys, ugly and airy and mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Poor Mr. Moon, a Debbie, guys. I think he had too much fun in the village. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. And here we are. 
It is hard to know where to start. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spell crafts, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. Rebellion. Revelio. Rebellion. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Rebellion. Right. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. 
Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory, or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Hello. Oh, come in! Come in! Welcome to Madame Snelling's Tress Emporium. <laughs> I'm sure I've no need to introduce myself. They used to call me Snelly. Oh, Snelly! Why aren't you studying to be an aura? But I showed them. They're stuck in the dust at the Ministry, and I'm here thriving. Stick it to the man, thriving. lady! But look at you. Look at you. I can certainly see why you paid me a visit. Looking for a change, are we? Why not, I say? What sort of change? Some are going for that muggle with consumption sort of death becomes me allure. But you won't find poisons here. No need for chloride of lime or ammonia when you have magic. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like to look? You can change your hair too if you'd like. What services do you offer? Let's see if we can find a better hairstyle or something. Oh, I could be. I guess what my hair used to look like when it was longer. Well, when it wasn't a ponytail. Hmm. 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 I'll keep my hair for now. Revelio.
There's cats! Rebellion. Repairer. Levioso. Revelio. Hold on a second. Wait Revelio. Well, uh, fuck you too, lady. Um, I'm supposed to talk to you. Revelio. Try this again. I'm gonna walk out the door. Kitty. <laughs> We're gonna go back in. Rebellion. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. 
Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neat. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm in the way inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Rebellion. Now I gotta visit the tome shop. Okay. I asked my friend earlier when I was gonna smoke. Hey, there like any other chests I should know about? She's like, oh, um, the, the chest you're gonna see with an eye. You don't have the spell for it yet, but it, um, you're gonna have to learn it later on. It's the uh, spell to make you invisible. I forgot she said it was called. Revelio. Rebellion. <laughs> Lumos. Yeah, I'm having fun with this. Yep. Ah. Gold. 
gold dragon spectacle? Okay, I gotta check out my new gear. An inquiring mind. Revelio. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Rebellion. Protego, Lumos. Fuck, I don't know where that is.
Revelio. Rebellion. 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 I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah, uh, mm. hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, yeah. uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you. Truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Hmm. Uh, no, no. No, not you. Um. Ah, yes. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches? Hmm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish. Guys, it's funny. Oh dear. I always like that. Well, this the ones isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> and the the ones are again matched with the people. We'll find like you something not to worry. There it is. Uh, Deadly Hollows uh, one. The one. The elder uh, one. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, thirteen and three quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Ones. Ready? Oh, 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 goodness. Oh, looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is going like to be trickier than I had pretty cool anticipated. Pretty cool, wand right there, like how you know you put a pencil or a cigarette um, or a pen. Where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, I'm praising this game so much. There you are. And I'm still in the early of the game. <laughs> I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Oh, sweet. I get to customize it? Holy hell, I get to customize a wand? That is fucking awesome. How intriguing. I 
Was it? Curious indeed. How intriguing. Go with that. That is awesome. You get to customize a wand. most reliable and faithful to its owner. That is awesome! What do you think? You get to customize a wand! That is awesome! Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. I'm, I'm now, fucking loving this game. How did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from uh, it. Sorry, my I'm eager to try it out. Indeed. Treat it well, and you shall find no more dependable a wand than one with a unicorn hair core. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new one's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Well, that's everything. Better go and find Natty. I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. I have a feeling. Oh shit! Something's gonna happen. This is Shrek. Shrek one, my favorite Pretty. movie. Ah oh, shit. Are we weakening him at all? Keep asking. We have to wet it down. Damn. What was that? I was trying to beat him at his own game. I let it do more. Shit. Okay, me. No, I want it. I like drinking my coke. There we go.
Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? Yeah, Hercules, Hercules, so. Hercules. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? Uh, I beard. We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Holy hell, like... Akio. Repairer. Repairer. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. This is the clothes guy. We were Finally. just talking about you. Now Thank you want sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And, as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we?
What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butterbeer. Shall we head to the Three Broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way then. My gear... Fingerless love gloves guy in this town. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Zerona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. I on. What am I gonna get? You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who's this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <sighs> Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. The you dude be well. looks like a lady. <laughs> You're gonna hear a lot of those jokes. Because I hate people. I hate yeah. everyone. I hate what myself I... every day. Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> looks like a it's lady. my first time there. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Yeah, down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say, trolls in Hogsmeade, that's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Uh, uh. That motherfucker! Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. Oh, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, you don't know my me. I'm just enjoying a well earned butterbeer. Anyway, I'm just a I student. You didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. Uh, I, I don't know this lady. One would think you all had okay. enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the Ovenus. The Three Broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butter beer forever. You gotta go to class soon. That's where I'll get you. Smoke bomb. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. 
Smoke bomb. Watch your back. Smoke bomb. Worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I can't tell anyone. I promise to Light tell a you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Light a cigarette. I can't tell you anything. Lights it. Tosses it. I think that now might be a good Alright. I'm gonna go for a smoke. And we'll be back soon. See you guys later.